this is Samantha Rawson. This is part of my Piranha Challenge, and I am here with Kamal. Um, so Kamal, we've been talking about your fitness and dietary goals, and one of your main goals is to kind of um, tone up, and particularly the stomach region. So we're just going to work through, and you talked about how you had a few dietary issues, so we're going to talk about what your diet is in general. Um, do you have any dietary requirements, like being vegetarian or allergies or anything like that? Um, no. So approximately how many serves of vegetables would you eat a day? A serve of vegetables is like half a cup of cooked vegetables, half a cup of lentils or chickpeas, um, a cup of salad veggies, so... Um, I would say... One, two to three. One. One? One, yeah. Um, about how many serves of fruit would you eat a day? So that would be like a medium fruit. Again, one. Yep. Yeah. Um, what about bread and cereals? How many would you be eating a day? Um, two. Two? What's the eat bread? Yep. Um, so what about dairy? So like it would be like a cup of fresh milk or um, two slices of cheese? Zero. Um, how many serves of meat or meat alternatives would you be consuming today? So that might be 65-ish um, grams of cooked bread meat, some, um, 80 grams of chicken, um, 100 grams of fish. Um, I usually eat chicken, so I would say I get all three meals of my day. So would say about three? Three, yeah. Um, discretionary choices. So this is, I know, my weakness. Treats. Um, so a serving would be, like, say, two scoops of ice cream, two to three um, sweet plain biscuits, one donut, um, 25 grams of chocolate, um, and one can of soft drink, um, those kind of things. And it's per week, not per day. But you know, if you have a per day, I think you would like extrapolate that kind of thing. Okay, so um, I eat like every day mm -hmm. biscuits and drinks, like pretty much every day. Yeah. Three times a day during my meals, you know? Yeah. Yeah, so you can say like, I don't know. So definitely more than 10 serves a week. Yeah. yeah. Which um, I also <laughs> am at that level. Um, and especially with the other ones being relatively low, um, would kind of be expected. Now, you're slightly underweight, so we don't want to really be restricting calories in any way, and that is one of the ways that you're getting a, a lot of calories. So I think our focus would probably be more on increasing the amount of vegetables and increasing the amount of fruit would probably be the first things that I would look at doing. Um, so I would say things like seeing if you can get, instead of, say, some of your biscuits, having a serve of fruit with, say, morning tea. Um, bananas are a really good one. If you are like me and you have ice cream, frozen bananas are an acceptable substitute. Sounds crazy, but works. So um, do you reckon you would be able to do something like swap, swap in fruit or maybe some of your biscuits? Yeah, it's different. Yeah. yeah. What fruits are your favourite? Oh, watermelon is my favorite. I don't know if it's going to add up to that. Well, I mean, um, the other thing is, you know, watermelon's coming in season, so this is the perfect time to start buying and, you know, get in some extras. Um, I think the would be to look at increasing vegetables. Probably I would start with, like, your night meal, just chucking even just some frozen veggies in, something that's easy, because I know you work in childcare. That's obviously a very demanding job. So, um, do you reckon you would be able to do something like that or something different? Or what do you think would work for you? No, I don't mind vegetables. I like corn, corn, corn. Yeah. So, yeah, frozen veggies, I reckon, are one of the easier options. Um, and yeah, there's heaps of frozen corn options. Um, are there any other things that you really? like or dislike or things that you could do that would make, say, your nutritional strategies a bit easier? I don't intake much sugar, like, I don't know. Yeah, so, so it's, it's, well, I, I like sugar, like, it's like, I don't like sugar. If it's something sweet, I don't like it. Okay, 
savoury treats. You like the savoury savoury treats? Yeah. Okay. Um, so are you, when you're having biscuits, are they like plain crackers or yeah. are they? Okay, so they're not the sweet biscuits. Um, and I think a really good option would be the plain crackers um, that would be to maybe add some cheese and that to them because the protein will keep you full for a while and also you're not getting any serves of dairy. So if you just put in a few um, bits of, little bits of cheese with um, the crackers, um, yeah. So um, we'll try those for a few weeks and then we'll reassess and see how you're going both with your goals and how you feel, whether these are easy to stick to, you, which ones you like, which ones you don't like. And yeah, so we'll reassess then. Okay.